we'll look at the electrophilic addition mechanism for hydrogen bromide with ethene now. Put the reactants, the two reactants up on the, the screen there. Now when it was BRBR, remember bromine is non-polar, identical electronegativity. HBr is actually a polar molecule because bromine has a higher electronegativity than hydrogen and so there would automatically be a dipole on this molecule. So pi electron pair in the double bond will be attracted to this hydrogen here because it's slightly positive. The electron pair is a lot closer to this electron pair so they get repelled onto this bottom bromine and it breaks the bond by heterolytic fission because the bottom bromine receives both of the electrons from the bond the hydrogen receives none. So the intermediate carbocation would be would look like this so effectively let's call this the new H that's been added on so this pair of electrons is this bond here. The carbon here is effectively lost an electron because it's over there now. This carbon's still got all four of its electrons and so we get a positive charge on this carbon. The bromine has received an extra electron effectively so we show it as a bromide ion and you can see that there will be an attraction, a movement of a pair of electrons to this positively charged carbon and we'd form a bond and make the product bromoethane. So it's the same mechanism, the only slight difference was the fact that it was HBr and not Br2. Again, why is it addition? Two reactants become one product.